Welcome to my channel and thanks for watching the video. In this video, I'm going to let you know how you can assemble um, the Vin Keep shopping cart, extra large heavy duty shopping cart. It's very easy. As you can see, this is how you can fold the handle. And for folding this, all you have to do is to push, push the um, this part or the base to the bottom so now you have it folded okay so let's just bring it backward sorry okay you need to keep this up and you need to put this down and then after you hear the uh, click sound it means that it's ready and then all you need to do is to just put this in place okay so that's how uh, this can be folded and with regards to the um, with regards to the uh, wheels it's really easy there's just one um, I don't know if you can see there's just one button here if you push okay, I'm not sure if I can do it as you can see if you push you can easily get it out which is not a good idea if you're in one person you should always Put this thing first. Okay. okay. And then by pushing it again, so let me just put it down, and then by pushing it again, very gently, you put this inside and then you release it. Okay? That's how you put the wheels in their place. Okay? Let's just try this one so that you can see pushing the button once. Okay, and then it releases. And then pushing it in again. And uh, when you when you put the wheel um, and it goes to the bottom, just release the button, and it will be in its place. Okay, that's how you can put things in. With regards to the bag, it's really simple. As you can see, there's just this part which goes which goes into this, and after you put it in. All you have to do is to use this velcro to just keep this in place very nice okay and i can say very roomy inside it's the, the plastic is kind of like the leather it's not leather but it's light leather so if it gets uh, dirty you can easily wash it so let me just show you too. this is how the inside is okay it's very roomy it is very kind of I would say uh, convenient in that regard. Uh, okay. As you can see uh, in the ad, it says it can carry up to um, 100 kilograms or 220 pounds. It has three wheels, which will make everything easier because it can climb the stairs. As, and as you can see, it's very soft. Okay. Um, what else? It's, it's, as I said, it's very roomy. It has like cushion here so your hands won't be bothered okay. you can also if you for example if you have like a, uh, something that you don't want to put in the bag you can again just remove the bag very simply like that and then uh, put whatever you want to the outside such as this bottle of water okay. very simple and it comes with it comes with this uh, um, stretchy uh, belt, so putting it is really easy. All you need to do is to put one side here, okay, one side here on this um, uh, iron or the handle or whatever you want to name it, and then put the other one underneath. And you can, if you want, you can just spread the two so that it has better grip. And if you want to, if you want to just uh, grab it, you have to put your feet right over here and then turn it uh, to your side. Okay. Uh, I think that's it for now. I'm gonna do a um, couple of tests so that you can see. Uh, but before that, let me just talk about uh, a couple of things. 
the first thing is the first thing that I think could be better is as you can see here this part is flat but this part the the back is kind of uh, arc arc type I really um, like it was vice versa I really like that this part which is flat comes in the back and then this part which is arc shape goes in front so that when you grab it it gives you more comfortable feeling honestly I feel like if I grab it like this it's more comfortable and the other thing is the packaging the packaging honestly I didn't like it it's kind of, as you can see it's just a simple cardboard and it's not a very um, I would say not a very firm one but the main important thing here is the device itself to work well for me so let me just as you can see let me just read out the dimensions to extended size is uh, 44 in 19 in 18 inches or 112 in 48 in 46 centimeter uh, folded dimension is uh, 26 in 16 in 11 inches or 66 in 40 in 28 centimeters and the, the back size only is uh, 15 in uh, 11 in um, 24 inches or 38 in 28 in 61 centimeters and the weight um, is the net weight is 8.8 uh, pounds or 4 kilos and the gross weight is 9.4 pounds or 6.2 6.27 kilograms okay so I'm gonna give you a uh, I'm going to give you a demo so that you can see um, uh, the maximum weight that it can carry. My weight is um, around 84 kilograms and this bottle of water uh, weighs um, around I think 13 kilograms. So it's going to be 96, 97 give or take, 97 kilograms. Let's see if it can uh, handle that. Okay, so as I said, uh, I weigh 84 kilograms and this package weighs around uh, 13 kilograms. So give or take, it's going to be 97 kilograms. And now we're trying to see if it can handle this much amount of weight. Yes, as you can see, it did. Yeah. Okay, so as you could see, it passed uh, the test for weight, but there are a couple of things that I want to talk about. The first one being this uh, link that it gives you to watch the video for um, like how to do uh, or assemble, although it's not needed, but I just want to mention that the video does not exist, so don't bother like going to this link to find the video, okay? Uh, it just explains very briefly in this uh, piece of paper on how you can uh, assemble this thing. This is the first thing. The second thing is um, this belt that you have here, the stretches, or you can, you can just uh, add more length to it so easily by just doing this. Okay, I'm not gonna do so because it's enough for me right now but in the store probably I will. It goes up to a maximum of 188 inches or uh, 477 centimeters, which is very good because let's say for example, you have something that is bulky and yet a heavy weight. So all, all you need to do is to just stretch this thing, this thing so that it just matches the um, size of your parcel or whatever you want to name it, okay? So this is the second thing. The third thing I want to talk about is, um, okay, let just put this away. The third thing is, as you can see, I'm not sure if you can see it in the video or not, but the brand for the base of this thing is Royi or something else. It's not uh, Vinkip. Now, I just don't know how things work all I know is um, sometimes people 
you know, order these type of uh, merchandise from Alibaba for very cheaper prices because Alibaba you can uh, actually order in bulk. Let's say, for example, they order 500 of these uh, with the price of probably, a, I don't know, maybe $10 or, or maybe more, $20, $30 but they sell it more expensive on Amazon. And I guess um, this is one of them. Whatever it is, to me, it sounds like um, sturdy. At least as you could see, it could tolerate 96 kilos with these. Okay. And, uh, um, but for what, for, for what it is, the price I guess is um, high. Um, I cannot tell you the price. You can check it on Amazon, uh, but the price was high, you know, uh, for this thing. Um, I'm gonna do another test for uh, you to see how it just uh, climbs the stairs uh, with um, three packs of water like that and how things go and go. Because uh, I, got, I got it like uh, just last night and I don't know how it can climb the stairs, whether it's comfortable or not, okay? Just one more thing before uh, leaving I forgot to mention uh, and that was the pockets that you get, so in front you get one pocket, the Velcro pocket. In both sides, you get this roomy, like these two roomy pockets. You can put your umbrella or whatever you want to put. In the back, you're gonna get one zipper pocket, which is also roomy, but it depends. If you put stuff, it might not be usable, but whatever it exists. And inside, you get another. Uh, uh, Velcro pocket, okay? It's pretty much very spacing. Okay, so I'm doing the test for this uh, card. Let's see how it goes that uh, stairs. Okay, that's pretty much good. Uh, it has like, um, this one is 13, as I said, 13 kilograms. So 13 multiplied by three, it's gonna be nearly 40 kilograms. Okay, so let me just go upstairs again. Yep, that's how it is. But the only thing that remains is that you need to uh, you need to take this and bring it over there like this, which could potentially um, give you some, uh, you know, make you some a little bit tired. That's why I wish the handle was a little bit longer. So what I always do is to do this. Okay. That is actually how I uh, handle heavy stuff. Okay, so uh, my final thoughts on this um, Vin Keep uh, uh, shopping cart or extra large heavy duty shopping cart is if you have the money then you can go for it but remember that um, for um, you know for value for the money or bank for the buck you're not gonna get that because in my opinion it's expensive so will I buy it again no probably not at this point not at sorry not at this price but um, will I recommend it to you yes for sure um, because it looks sturdy and it does the job However, there are a couple of things that I think they can uh, make to, uh, you know, they can do to make this thing better. The first thing is they can make the handle um, longer. So if they can make the handle a little bit longer, it would be easier to carry heavy stuff. Um, they can also put um, some, you know, at least one wheel or two wheels in front. That would be, you know, that would make uh, moving it around easier. And my experience was like this thing oh, i have to tell you this thing uh, i don't know what it is but it broke it just broke and came out as you can see there's just like one uh screw type thing in there that it you know that goes underneath here which has a hole and it uh, with the first time use it just came off so um as I said, you can get pretty much like the lowest, you know, with a little bit uh, less capacity than this, you can get uh, far more cheaper than this thing. But uh, I would say I would keep it because of the ease of uh, stair climbing, as you could see. 
and also for now it does the job. Um, something that I have to also mention is I um, sent them a message in Amazon about the handle that I wished it was longer and also about the wheels that I wish it had like uh, two wheels in front and I asked them if they have or not and also I uh, told them about the price and they said that uh, um, they don't have and for just compensation they offered me a gift card so all in all i want to say their customer care is very good but as i said i believe um, you don't get value for the money that you pay uh, with this price that i can say i cannot say but uh, today is 31st of uh, uh, july so you can you know search the internet to see search amazon uh, with the link um, to get the price on this date um, but like as I said, it's expensive um, for the price that you pay. Um, it's not good, for, uh, as I said, for value for the money, but um, I still recommend it.